And a group of Austin firefighters are pleading with drivers to pay attention after a crash over the weekend. A crew from Fire Station 20 were called out along Stastny Lane on Saturday when a driver plowed into the fire truck. KXAN's Candy Rodriguez spoke with the firefighter who was almost tossed from the truck during that crash. Cut that first. For firefighter Meredith Geary, some days can bring more challenges than others. It was definitely, definitely a eye-opening experience. Today, Geary is thankful. Thankful the call her crew responded to this past weekend didn't turn deadly. It's really, really scary to think, what if he had been two feet over and I'd been standing on the ground? The driver in a Jeep Cherokee ran into the back of the fire truck, causing the truck's bumper to fall off, air bottles to fly out, and Gary to quickly react. My arm hit something over here and I held on and it kind of threw me backwards. Um, luckily, I was hanging on. Her fellow crew members worried. I, I can't even tell you what was running through my mind. Austin Fire Division Chief Thayer Smith says close calls like this are happening too often. Uh, I believe one of the most dangerous things we do is sending our crews out on the highway every day. A law passed in 2003 was meant to keep first responders safe by having drivers move over or slow down when passing an emergency vehicle. But firefighters say some drivers need a reminder. Pay attention to the road, pay attention to the other drivers, and then give those responders that space to do what they need to do. In Austin, Candy Rodriguez, KXAN News. Fire Division Chief Smith says four trucks have been hit by drivers since the beginning of last year. The Austin Police Department responded to the accident and says the driver was not arrested. Whether or not the driver will receive a citation is still under review at this time. Earlier this month, an Austin police officer was hit while working a crash on FM 973 south of Texas Highway 71. The driver took off. The officer was not seriously hurt. Police are still searching for that driver.